You're also going to want to modify the subscription template. And here's what I mean by that. If we go to the home page, I'm going to click on subscription here. This is what's in here hard coded. And it tells you what you get with the subscriptions that came with the package pre-installed, which we're not using, of course. And we're going to have different things on here. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to modify this template. So let's go back to admin, system, and then down here to templates. And you notice that we have three different templates within here. Now what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to clone this template set and then change the one we want. So click on clone, then we give it a new name. Call it whatever you want and submit. And then back to template manager. Now the reason we have to do this, I should have chosen that first. If we go into subscription and we list in here, you'll see that we can view or download what we want to change, but we can't edit it. Now if we go into here, we now have an edit option. Now what we're looking for is a subscription index. Subscription index.html. This is the one that we need to edit. So go into edit. Now this is all in HTML. So what we want to do is it's pretty easy to figure out what you want to want to get rid of. So choose one of the options below. We want to keep that. Okay, so what we're going to want to get rid of, actually, is this table here. So first we start with table like that. So what we're looking for is another table statement with a slash in front of it. We want to get rid of everything in between there. The first one we find, which is right there. Okay, so if we kill that, okay, so let's just submit that. go back to preferences and general settings and then we have to we have default template set we now have to change that to the name of the new set that we created and then save that okay let's go to the home page and subscriptions okay so that's okay to there. So now what we want to update is everything below from your order down. All the top is the way we want it. So we'll go back to admin again. And we'll go back to templates. And to subscription and then back to subscription index your subscription template. Go into edit again. Okay, and then everything from here down, we could just remove this for now. Okay, and down to this slash TD here. Nuke all that out of there. Okay, and then we can put something else in here if we want. And this would have to be an HTML. So we could put, like this is bold, and then you can place some text in here. Submit. And then go to the home page. And we'll look at subscriptions. Now if you're not happy with that, you can always go and go to a uh, web template editor or website editor like composer that you can download for free and type up what you want in there and then paste the html code where the code that you took out was and just paste it down here and then it'll show up with what you want but well, that's it that's how we modify the subscription template